Hello and we are students from the Cerebral Broadard Academy. Our project is called MELT, which stands for Monitoring Our Environment Learning for Tomorrow. Our project entails for us to tackle climate change. Currently, climate change is a global issue. This is mainly due to more and more people emitting greater amounts of carbon dioxide out into the atmosphere. Robert Swan, who is there, who was the first man to walk to both poles, has launched the Climate Force 2041 project. They aim to remove 326 million tonnes of carbon dioxide out of the atmosphere by 2025. So to calculate our school's carbon footprint, we use something called the carbon calculator. To use this, we need to collect information relating to our utilities, waste and fuel costs. We then put this into the carbon calculator and it then calculates the amount of calculates the carbon footprint our school produces over the course of the period of a year. We discovered that over the last year that our school <coughs> produced almost 3,000 tonnes of carbon dioxide. This is, um, this is close to three tonnes per person. By the end of the year, we're going to repeat this to see if we have improved the carbon footprint that we have produced as a school. So the triangle behind me shows our main ideas on reducing the carbon emission levels of our school. So our main idea was the carbon merit, and this will hopefully be added into our behaviour system and awarded to a student every time they remind a teacher to turn off their electronic devices. <laughs> <laughs> this is also a carbon zero way of encouraging students to reduce their carbon emission. As young scientists, we've developed many skills by working with IRIS, such as being able to discuss our project with world-renowned scientists actively researching in the field, as well as presenting at the Royal Society and at student conferences. We would, uh, we would not otherwise get this opportunity if we, weren't, uh, if we weren't working with IRIS, and it's such a big honour to be able to doing it. We wouldn't really get this opportunity until we went to university. We, uh, our MELT project has also inspired a new Year 7 environmental group uh, with their initiative using the hashtag Unmuck the World. Uh, during our time on this uh, IRIS project, we have um, faced a couple of challenges. Uh, our main, uh, the main challenge we faced is uh, being nervous uh, on, in front of big crowds, which in <laughs> retrospect is a, a little bit ironic, uh, <laughs> given the circumstance. So, um, but the way we combated this is by going to a a school near our near our school, and um, gave an assembly to um, some some children from their school. Uh, this helped us boost our confidence and learn how to what not to say in front of people. <laughs> so a skill I specifically gained was my confidence in talking in front of peers. To gain this school, we have spoken in front of our local feeder primary schools and recently given a speech to our local MP Tim Loughton. As well as this, uh, events and competitions such as the Big Bang and Silvercrest Awards have helped us improve our presentation skills and just given us the confidence to talk about you. <laughs> Thank you all for listening to us talk about our project. We would love to take any questions and answer them about our project and give any further details in the poster session.